Few important tips for job interview. Be on time. This often means 10 to 15 minutes early. Interviewers often are ready before the appointment. Know the interviewer's name, its spelling, and pronunciation. Use it during the interview. If you don't know the name, call beforehand and ask the secretary. Also, note the secretary's name in case you have to call back. Secretaries can influence the hiring decision. Have some questions of your own prepared in advance. There is nothing wrong with having a short list of questions and thoughts that shows you have done your research and want to know more about the organization and the position. Bring several copies of your resume. Also, bring a copy of your transcript. Carry your papers in an organized manner. Have a reliable pen and a small notepad with you. But do not take notes during the interview. However, immediately afterward, write down as much as you can remember, including your impression of how well you did. Greet the interviewer with a handshake and a smile. Remember to maintain eye contact. Expect to spend some time developing rapport. Don't jump right in and get down to business. Follow the interviewer's lead. Don't be embarrassed if you are nervous. This just normal. As you gain experience, you'll become more at ease with the interviewing process. Focus. On your attributes, your transferable skills, and your willingness to learn. Don't apologize for a lack of experience. Describe your strengths in terms of what you can do for the organization. Tell the truth. Never tell the lies. Interviewers can find the truth and disqualify you. Listen carefully to the interviewer. Be sure you understand the question. If not, ask for clarification. Watch your grammar. Employers are interested in candidates who can express themselves properly. Even if you have to go slowly and correct yourself, accuracy is preferred over ungrammatical fluency. Be prepared for personal questions. Some interviewers may not know what they can and cannot ask legally. Handle such questions without losing your composure. Wait for the interviewer to mention salary and benefits. Don't ask interviewers salary and benefits first. Wait for the interviewers to start a discussion on this subject. Don't expect a job offer at the first interview. Often you will be invited to a second or even third interview before an offer is made several weeks later. Close on a positive, enthusiastic note. Ask what the next step will be. Thank the interviewer for his or her time and express your interest in the job. Leave quickly and courteously with a handshake and a smile. No interview is complete until you follow up with a thank you note. Express your appreciation for the interview and, if true, reaffirm your interest. This last step can make a difference. Don't forget it.